This is just one of three areas under construction at the Novoselo Training Area in eastern Bulgaria, a massive training base that has hosted and will continue to host training for U.S., Bulgarian, and Allied troops when construction completes in 2012. Clearly, whenever we go somewhere, we want to go as part of a large international team. And that is the future for uh, all soldiers and units in the Army and in the Joint Force. And so they, uh, they need to practice it, and they can practice it here at this site once it's established. Through working hand-in-hand -hand with U.S. Army Europe, the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers is on the ground overseeing the construction to ensure that arriving units can comfortably reside and train here. You're going to be able to uh, sustain yourself very comfortably. You know, there are barracks. There are battalion and company operations facilities, aid stations, vehicle maintenance facilities that are fixed and uh, very, they'll be very modern. So the focus will be to maximize training time once you're here. So the, the base area will be elaborate enough with dining facilities, some uh, recreation facilities, so that units can come here. They don't have to worry about absorbing a huge amount of their personnel or their time in just life support activities, which can happen if you go to really austere training sites. You, you don't get the same training benefit because so much of your force and your time is consumed just sustaining yourself. Uh, here they're going to be able to do that uh, very easily, and they're going to be able to focus on the maneuver and firing training that's going to be done here. The $50 million design build project is in support of Task Force East, an ongoing UCOM and USER commitment to train and build mutual capabilities with our partner nations at sites like these. I think it's going to be a great facility that uh, will grow in its desirability and use as people come through and see how, how good it is. Justin Ward, U.S. Army Corps of Engineers, Novosela Training Area, Bulgaria. Yeah.